Good morning. It's Thursday, June 17th, and this morning I'm reading from Jesus Calling uh, Sarah Young. This one's a fitting one for me this morning. Learn to laugh at yourself more freely. Don't take yourself or circumstances so seriously. Relax and know that I am God with you. When you desire my will above all else, life becomes much less threatening. Stop trying to monitor my responsibilities, things that are beyond your control. Find freedom by accepting the boundaries of your domain. Laughter lightens your load and lifts your heart into heavenly places. Your laughter rises to heaven and blends with angelic melodies of praise. Just as parents delight in the laughter of their children, so I delight in hearing my children laugh. I rejoice when you trust me enough to enjoy your life lightheartedly. Do not miss the joy of my presence by carrying the weight of the world on your shoulders. Rather, take my yoke upon you and learn from me. My yoke is comfortable and pleasant. My burden is light and easily borne. She's got several verses. Uh, Proverbs 17, 22. A cheerful heart is good medicine, but a crushed spirit dries up the bones. Proverbs 31, 25. She is clothed with strength and dignity. She can laugh at the days to come. Matthew 1, 23. The virgin will be with child and will give birth to a son, and they will call him Emmanuel, means God with us. And finally, Matthew 11, 29 to 30. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle, meek, and humble, lowly in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is wholesome, uh, useful, good, not harsh, sharp, hard, sharp, oppressing, but comfortable, gracious, and pleasant. And my burden is light and easy to be borne. Yeah, it's, I often forget that. I get, I get worried about things, too many things. Um, and do take myself too seriously at times, more often than I should. Um, not saying that you never should take yourself seriously, but uh, with, with a grain of, of um, understanding that uh, things will resolve, things will will happen and um, you know sometimes I can make a difference in what my decisions are sometimes I don't sometimes I just have to accept what is and and uh, it's the whole serenity burn of just accepting and understanding what I can change and what I can't and accept that whatever happens but um, yeah especially you know during this COVID time and there's been studies now proving that the, our brains are just not quite normal, I should say. Um, kids don't remember as much on, online as opposed to being in person. And there's a disconnect there. Uh, sometimes we act a little bit erratically and not like we normally do. Um, there's just a lot of things they're uncovering with, with being in shutdown for so long uh, without being in a kind of normal environment or normal sense of our daily lives. Uh, and to go into the daily lives now slowly and, and um, like I said going into the weight room after after a year and doing it slowly and lightly and and not as much time just taking it easy um, but yeah knowing that that God is with us and, and letting God lift the burdens and carry the burdens uh, for us uh, not saying that we're not responsible for anything we just do whatever we want but some of the stuff we worry about is probably not going to happen um, and a lot of time and energy is wasted in it. Um, think about Isaac. He was named Isaac, which means laughter. So I think there's a lot to be said for that. Even the Native Americans feel that when you're laughing, it opens up the spirit to uh, invite the spirit in. So we'll keep that in mind. But uh, I had to think about not taking myself so seriously and not worrying so much and letting God. You know. Anyway, let's pray. Gracious and loving God, you take all that we give you and you offer to take more. Help us to be centered on you and not take ourselves so seriously um, that you have our best interests at heart and that we can live life a little bit more lighthearted uh, and enjoy this life and enjoy people as much as we can um, to deal with things we need to deal with, but know that you're with us. 
Uh, in your name we pray. Amen. All right. So until tomorrow, have a blessed, lighthearted day.